So what they found is people are using these things for relationships, for therapy, mm -hmm. for friendship, for emotional support. And that didn't get tested enough or weighted enough in their testing. And when they put this thing out there and you're using it for like therapy and the thing, let's say you're saying, Hey, I'm having these negative thoughts. And it's like, okay, yeah, keep playing out those negative thoughts. Like it's always just like building on what you're giving it and not saying like, well, hold on, like maybe you shouldn't feel that way. So I think they actually ran into a bunch of safety issues related to some of these things because the model was just encouraging people, no matter what their thoughts were, they were never telling them they were wrong, never mm -hmm. telling them maybe to think about a different perspective. So, yeah, I mean, this is, I could talk for an hour on this one. Like it's so fascinating on so many levels, but I think it does highlight the increasing importance of who the people are and which labs are building these technologies that are going to have a massive impact and already are on society. I mean, they have 700 million users of ChatGPT weekly. Yep. XAI has Grok, has Zuckerberg. They have a billion users of Meta AI. And it's like, do you trust those people to be building the things that your kids are going to be interacting with their entire lives? It's wild. And this shows you like they don't know what they're creating.